Now be honest, oh my God, this room echoes like crazy. So let's just turn my microphone on so the echo isn't as bad. I hope that's a little bit better. Clearly we haven't bought enough furniture yet for this place not to be just sounding like a warehouse. But anyway, be honest with me, when you saw me pop up in your subscription boxes, did any of you say, hmm, who's that girl again? <laughs> I've actually been away for two weeks. I very quietly kind of disappeared off into the background because I didn't want to make a big song and dance about the fact I was going to be away from the internet for two weeks because I kind of felt like if I didn't say anything then people wouldn't maybe notice but then I started getting a few tweets and Instagram DMs and stuff of people saying Ellie where are you? I went to Lanzarote for two weeks and yes it was amazing it was a nice little break it was a nice little relaxing time away from screens because morning afternoon and evening and into the early hours of the morning too sometimes um, I'm looking at screens and it was just really nice to kind of look at views instead or just read books I read three books it was lovely thank you for that break I really appreciate it I don't like having a hairband on my wrist it's annoying but now I'm back I'm not gonna be talking about that too much because there will be a, a little vlog where I've just posted random snip bits from the holiday there's not it's not really a very good vlog but I'll be posting more information on the holiday later on but for now coming back has perfectly timed with a really fun opportunity that I wanted to share with you lot. I've been sponsored by Uniqlo. I hope I'm pronouncing that right, but they are a really big Japanese clothing company and they do all sorts of stuff on their website. They have a, a physical store as well, but I'm not located near one, I don't think. But they are online and they have done collaborations with lots of other different um, kinds of companies. Is that the right word before? Or like themes or whatever. Like they've done a collaboration with Disney, for example. Their most recent one was actually with manga and they asked me if I wanted to sit down and open up their new range with you guys today and it comes in this little bag as if I've almost been shopping in their store but I haven't it's all a big con they actually sent me this collection and I don't actually know what it looks like but people tend to think you know youtubers or instagrammers just kind of blindly accept any kind of sponsorship that comes their way if I don't like the stuff in their in their bag they would totally understand if I was to tell them look I don't want to be promoting these products because they're not something I would wear you guys are gonna see me wearing them in the future if I told you that I like them in this and if you don't see me wearing them in the future and I told you I liked them then call me a big fat liar and unsubscribe from my channel <laughs> yes to see their entire range that came out whilst I was on a holiday actually so it's been out for a, a few days now but to see their entire range you can click the link down there in my video description and it will take you straight to their stuff and without Without much further ado, let's see some of the stuff. I'm pumped because I'm just, I'm just a little bit nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous. I should have total faith. Here are all the clothes. I'm already seeing lavender, the color purple, like pastel purple. So that's already a win in my eyes. Honestly, so nervous. Straight away, I'm gonna pick. <gasps> Okay, hold on. Look at the first little thing I can see here. I don't know what that even is. Like a little, it's like a little planet and a and leg. It's a leg. Ellie's gonna like it if there's a leg involved. It says on the back here, manga and anime are a proud part of entertainment and culture in Japan. Childlike playfulness and aspirations of becoming a hero continues in adulthood. Yes. A collection with original designs of series that are loved by all ages and genders throughout the world. So already this feels really nice. I already love it. It's so playful and so cute and pretty. And you guys know I kind of like having a cutesy sort of style that meets kind of gothic -y grunge. So I like mixing creepy and cute together in my style because I just think that speaks much more volume. This, um... Length seems really strange. I don't know how it's gonna sit on me, but we shall see because I will, of course, be doing a try on. I think it goes with my hair, although I will be changing my hair color soon. Oh, not gonna tell you what that is until that happens. Good solid starting point. I really hope I like the other things they chose for me. I wonder if they like chose things specifically because they knew I would like the thing or whether they just, I don't know. Ooh, this is different. I feel like Adam would like this. It's a shame this is a girl's fit. I want to know like the background deets behind this design. This is really cute. I can so see my boyfriend in this. It's a real shame he can't have one of these. This is much more darker and more masculine, I suppose. There's a more like rivalry theme behind this design. <gasps> Ooh. 
this is nice. My two favorite colors to wear other than black is white <laughs> and like pinks and pastel pinks. By the way, all of these uh, shirts are in a medium. So obviously I can't read any of this, which is um, super annoying because I'm, I'm here trying to like show you their new collection, but I'm like, no idea what it says. But what would be really, really cool Oh my God, I would love if this could happen, is if anyone could let me know in the comments, like if you can read this. To be fair, I'm not even sure if you're gonna be able to uh, read it from that far, but regardless, I love the kind of style of it. And obviously part of it looks quite romantic. There's scenes here of this guy and a girl, I think it looks like. Or maybe, is that even two women? I don't know, but it looks really, really lovely. And the, the blue, up against the pink looks really like they complement each other really well. Just the style is so, so sweet. I'm gonna have to vote which one's my favorite to my least favorite. It says on it, Detective Conan or Conan. Once again, this has a totally different vibe to the rest. Oh, these feel really soft, by the way. It's just got the um, a little print of the detective guy, which I've never even heard of this anime, let alone uh, given it a chance before. But if any of you guys have, then let me know and I will probably go give it a bash. What would be amazing is if I was to give any of these a try and then fall in love with them and then know that I've got some of their merch. That would be really wicked. If you guys could let me know some of your favorite anime, what you really watch, your ma favorite anime, uh, favorite manga. When I say manga to you, what's the, thir the first thing that comes to mind? I really like the pieces that they picked out for me, particularly these two are definitely coming up strong as my two favorites. I'm excited to, to pair these up with cute little dungarees or like a high-waisted skirt or something. The fit's very different. Like it's, it's very different to the kind of shirts I wear in a weird way because it's kind of like a square shape rather than a long rectangle and that kind of just means it slouches differently and it fits differently to other clothes that I have. Guys, I want to thank Uniqlo for asking me to celebrate their new manga launch. I want you guys to check out the launch in case you like any of the stuff on it. And I want to thank you guys for appreciating this sponsor on my channel. I got an itchy nose. And as always, all kinds of clothing brands that you guys recommend I review on my channel is welcome. So give me the suggestions down there and I will take them all on board and do what I can. If you wanna check out some holiday pics and stuff that I'm about to be posting up on uh, Instagram and Twitter, mainly Instagram actually, then you can check them out. I'm on social media as Poop on pretty much everything, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, everything. I'm excited to be back on this channel posting regular content again. It felt really nice to get away from social media, but at the same time, I missed you. So I hope you missed me too and didn't forget who I was, even though I've cut my hair. Do I do I look like a different person now? Do you Have you genuinely forgotten who I am? <laughs> I know I have. I went to Lanzarote to find myself, but I lost it on the way. Bye everyone. <laughs>